We've seen a couple of the ladies of Nippon Ichi Software Great Edo Blacksmith, which puts players in the role of a character with only one year to live. He needs to use them wisely and aims to make money blacksmithing and ultimately falling in love with the right girl before it's too late. Which is really anyone's dream. One of these girls is Asaka, voiced by Shizuka Tsuji, who is cheerful and honest but also quite greedy. See if she has potential as the right fit for our hero. Fans of both puzzle games and fairy tale have a new title to look forward to. With Taito set to release Fairy Tale Brave Saga in Japan, the puzzle RPG Battler features cheaper versions of the manga and anime series cast, and it's coming to iOS and Android this fall. An example has been shown by Brave Saga. Figure maker Wave is juxtapositioning body types for their latest 110 scale Beach Queen figure offerings. A certain scientific railgun S. Shizuru Muguri and friend uh, Sivalan have been scheduled for February 2015 at 6,696 yen each with Norin's Ringo Kinoshita and Mon Minori Nakazawa are due in March for the same price. Now, I actually really want to get these figures for quite obvious reasons. Back in August, the 15th anniversary of Digimon Adventure was celebrated with the announcements of a sequel anime featuring a 17-year-old Tai with a high school age cast. Now that project site has been updated with a new message. Yuzuki Murata, the artist of the Ice Shield 21 manga and more recently the highly regarded One Punch Man, which you should really check out as it's just hilarious, was having fun on Tumblr, Twitter this week. In addition to live streaming his OPM work, he posted some corner doodles of Studio Gilby's crossovers and his dream matchup of Godzilla vs. Gamera. And that's all the anime news for today. Tune in next time for more news.